24 News is your local election headquarters. You have only about six hours left if you need to register to vote for the August 2nd Tennessee primary and general election for Shelby County. And you'll have to do it online, which is a new option this year. But before the election commission offices close tonight, Local 24's Mike Matthews spoke to one man who showed up in person about why he says it's so important to vote. It is amazing at times to hear the stories of people who come down to register to vote. He was the only man in line, friendly. We talked about Memphis, about voting, about how difficult it is to be a Muslim in American society. Let me ask you something. How big a deal is this for you? It's a very important deal. It's a matter of survival as far as Muslims are concerned. Dr. Nabil Biakli has been in this country 40 years. He has been a citizen for 10 years. He is a Muslim that has experienced hate and anger from others just because of his faith. Memphis is a little different, he says. In Memphis, there are many people who remember being treated differently because of the color of their skin. He says voting is important to change what he sees happening. Coming from, from D.C. and from Nashville, so we're trying to change things around. We're a little different here in the city. In Memphis, yes. That's good. Yes, that's great. Uh, and we want to do the, we want to uh, export whatever is in Memphis to all over the state. Just like the Irish did in Boston more than a century ago just like African Americans did in the South more than half a century ago. People realize the best way to change things is at the ballot box. The August 2nd election will change things. And there are many new registrations, especially coming in online. On the last few days, we've gotten over 3,000, so that's pretty busy for the last week. So, and I don't know how many of those will be address changes and how many of them will be new registrations. Linda Phillips says between 25, maybe 30 percent, maybe 30 percent, will vote in the August 2nd primaries. An average turnout, she says. In Memphis, Mike Matthews, Local 24 News.